Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Amaryllis and in today's video I'm going to talk to you guys about my laser hair removal experience. Ah, I know, painful, but um, I just wanted to give you guys the background story as to why I got um, the laser hair removal and then give you um, the answers to the common questions that most people have. And so yeah, I hope that you guys find this video helpful. So let's get started. So background as to why I decided to get laser hair removal. So uh, I started off shaving as most women do and I have thick hair like all my legs and underarms and everything. So when I would shave I never really got like that smooth shave like other girls would get and I was always just like, I'm gonna be honest, like I hate my body hair. Like that's probably like my biggest thing that I'm not like, I don't really like about my body. Um, I tried to embrace everything about myself, um, which is why I even started this channel, embracing my curly hair. But anyways, let's not get into that. Um, but yeah, so I started off shaving and then I would get wax. And I would just get Brazilian waxes and it was painful, but I got used to it and it wasn't bad unless I just like waited too long or whatever. But um, yeah, the one thing that I think I didn't like about waxing was I had to keep waiting a four week period to then get waxed again. And I live in California and some of my friends have um, pools. And so like if I get invited to go to a pool party, if I was in between that in between stage, I couldn't shave because shaving, once you shave, then you have to wait a whole month to get waxed. And then when you do, it hurts even more. Um, and so I just would never want to shave. And then I never wanted to like mess up that flow. So it just became inconvenient and I knew that I didn't want the hair on my body so I was like you know what I'm gonna go check out go for a consultation and see what they say because one of my friends told me and, and someone else had who had gotten laser hair removal were about like my skin tone um like medium skin tone and they said mm, sometimes it doesn't really work out for our skin tone because we're a little too tan and the laser can't find the hair and I'm like Oh, that sounds kind of weird, but I did hear that there's this like stereotype that once you have like medium to deeper skin that it was harder for you to get laser hair re hair removal. So I went in and I asked about that and she said, no, our technology um, has um, gotten better and like anyone can pretty much get hair removal. Essentially what the um, laser does is that when you shave, it looks for that follicle and once it sees that dark follicle, it zaps it. And that's what the hair removal process is. So it's not about your skin color. It's about the laser being able to find that dark um, follicle. And so if you have thicker, dark follicles, then it'll find it like that. So you're good um, in that regard. And the place that I went to was Laser Away. And they have two different types of laser, um, I guess, like machines. So they're, you know, and I'm sure you guys seen them on Instagram and all over the place and that's how I found them so I was like let me check them out and um, yeah they're so nice I had great experience every time I went there they're the sweetest women I've ever like been to like a salon or something like that great they're so great and I loved everyone there had a great experience so I would definitely recommend them I went to the place in Pasadena so they were awesome and then when it came to pricing um, it was a little over a thousand dollars I can't remember but I got a package um, for my underarms and my Brazilian. So yes, girl, not just the bikini line, everything, okay? Um, but yeah, so um, I got the package and you might think, wow, that's expensive, but when I was getting just my waxing for just Brazilian, I spent over $1,000 in those four years. So I knew that if I continued to wax, I was gonna continue to spend more money. So at the time, it was more expensive, but I did get that payment plan, so it helped out. And it's totally worth it. Um, they give you six sessions. They suggest six sessions every six weeks, and you should keep up with that. I didn't, and um, they also give you two extra um, sessions, so you have eight in total for both areas. And those two treatments are for, you know, touch-up treatments, but I definitely needed all eight. I might even need a touch up for my underarms um, because I did miss that six month, um, six week period. And so I think that um, it didn't really do 
remove as much hair as I wanted it to. Um, still definitely worth it, um, but I might have to get um, treatments again. So when it comes to the pain, is it painful? Yes, girl. Yes, it is painful, but I have a low um, pain tolerance and I didn't do the numbing cream because when I was reading, it said something about like it can change the pigment of your skin and so I didn't want anything like that to happen. So I just wanted like smooth, smooth area, no hair. I didn't want to mess with that. So I was like, you know what, girl, you're going to have to deal with the pain. And honestly, yes, it is painful, but it lasts for just a few minutes and for a few seconds in those areas. And then I did turn red. I have sensitive skin. I did turn red, but the next day, like you're fine. And even an hour later, you're fine. It doesn't hurt or anything like that. You're not like, oh my God, I'm in pain. Um, so yes, I I would suggest not to do the numbing cream, but it's up to you and your pain tolerance and what you want to do. So yeah. And then when it comes to sun exposure, which is a really important thing, they told me that two weeks before you get it done and two weeks um, after, you shouldn't be in the sun. You shouldn't expose those areas to the sun because it can cause pigmentation as well. So when the laser is like, it's like little dots, like boop, 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 boop. Um, those areas can look spotty if you go into the sun. One of the girls told me that um, she had a client who was getting their legs done and then they had dots all over their legs. And I was just like, oh, that's not cute. So yeah, you would want to avoid that. So um, yeah, I started in the winter time so that I can be like all, you know, bikini ready for the summertime. So depending on where you live and when you want to get it done, I would suggest get it done during those months where you know you're not going to get as much sun exposure. And if you are, just stick to the rule two weeks before and two weeks after or whatever they suggest for you. Now when it, can, when it comes to me, my bikini area, I definitely noticed the biggest difference. Um, when I shave, I can't even remember when was the last time I shaved, like I, I literally am like, I can't even remember, it's been a while. And then when it comes to my underarms, that I mentioned before, I do see hair grow back. Um, I did get eight sessions. I just got my eighth one a week ago. So I am hoping that that has helped to remove more hair. And if not, I will definitely go back and get touch-ups. And I definitely want to go and get my legs and my stomach and just pretty much any other areas that need touch-up. And so, yeah, I definitely suggest um, laser hair away and laser hair removal. I had a great experience. I think it's totally worth it. If you are interested, you should definitely get a consultation with a professional. And yeah, that is it for my laser hair removal story and background. And I hope that I answered some common questions that most of you may have before you go in for a consultation. And yeah, um, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, please give me a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. Let me know down in the comments. Are you thinking about getting laser hair removal? Do you think it's like too painful? Nah, girl. Like you got some balls to be doing that. Um, yeah, just let me know in the comments. Let's chat. Oh, another thing. I am thinking about getting the machine so that I can try it out on my legs. That so you can do like laser hair removal at home, like a Groupon or something. Um, so let me know if you want me to, you know, demo that and show you my thoughts and all of that about it. And yeah. Anyways, I will see you guys in my next video. Have a great day. Bye! So this is where I go to get my laser done. Well, I finished my session. So yeah, just wanted to show you guys where I go. Really nice, clean place. I really enjoyed my experience here.